It's five days till Christmas, and Luce's bad luck is snowballing. I'm sorry, but your card was declined. Now I can't buy Christmas gifts for anyone else? But when she's offered a dog walking job. Oh, no, no, no. I, I'm not a dog person. I wouldn't even know what to do with him. <sighs> Worst Christmas ever. She'll learn that regaining the holiday spirit. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, my gosh. Just takes a little change of heart. Get off me. You can get off me now. You're on me. Oh, great. Yeah. You like her? Hank! I think she just needs a little more dog in her life. Now, Luce's new boss is planning to tear down the park. If Tog's only paid rent, huh? This spa is going to bring jobs to this town. And she'll have to make a choice. You're going to help convince your boss not to bulldoze the park. Trust me, you don't want my help. I'm bad luck. To keep this Christmas. You're our Christmas miracle. No, what? From being ruined. We're working to save the park. Nice to meet you. Wait, what? Mar Vista Entertainment presents. Ultimately, if we can't save it, at least we went out with a bang, right? Or a bark. Come on, that was good. Jonathan Bennett, Lexi Giovanoli, and Dina Meyer in a romantic Yuletide story about learning the true meaning of Christmas and that the best gifts are the ones you can't buy. A Dog Walker's Christmas Tale.